my channel. It's me, Rebel. And as always, I gotta give my parental advisory. I tend to cuss like a sailor, and I could also talk like a pervert. So if you ain't into that, exit stage left. You ain't gonna hurt my feelings, none, because I know I ain't everybody's cup of tea. And anyways, we have Shock Miss A-Hall number two for the week. Um, this one is very small, but very fun. So let's just go ahead and just jump into this bag. Uh, this one I just ordered this week, and damn if they didn't get on the ball, and I got it Friday. Well, it was a, well, I didn't pick it up till this morning, this Saturday, but it was here Friday. So, like I said, they finally shop and say either got their acts together or the shipping company got their acts together. I wish they keep it like this. It, it works out a lot better for all of us consumers of shop and say. So we don't have to sit there and worry about where's our package and it's been too much, you know. So. Anyway, it's enough about that. Uh, if you don't know what Shop Miss A is, it's like the Dollar Tree of the web. <laughs> everything, just about everything, is a dollar on their website. There are some things that are a little higher than a dollar that typically they go to their charities. They have several charities that they give to, so the extra coin goes to the charities. But typically, everything, although there's a dollar, usually everything I buy is a dollar, so... Like this necklace, for example. It's bugging the crap out of me. It's already itching. So, I'm going to be taking this off soon. But, it was a dollar from Dollar Tree. So, the first thing I got was this really cute owl pin. I like hootie owls. And it lights up. Oh, well. It won't stay lit up. There you go. He glows pink. I don't know why he won't stay lit. Uh, now he is. Okay. That was really cute. I could always use a pin. Uh, huh, it even has this little tiny rubber thing on the ball point of it. I guess to keep it from... From leaking. Oh, here comes Caden. Uh, it's gonna get loud. I can't ever have a quiet video. If, if it ain't Katie making noise in the background of here, it's Brandon making noise in the background of the bedroom. So, what I might do is I might pause this video and see if he goes back because he's being extremely loud and it's gonna get louder. So, stay tuned. I will be right back. Okay, he went back to his bedroom. I knew it was gonna get loud because he was watching a video. Now, every time he watches this video. He gets all hyperactive and starts making a lot of noise and stuff, so. Had to wait 10 minutes for him to get over that. Then he finally, he's went back to his bedroom, so. Um, so yeah, the rest of this, I'm going to tell you, is sunglasses. I went sunglass crazy. I've got a very good subscriber on my channel, Miss Mama K. Mama K always... She lets a girl know when Shop Miss A has glasses. So she's always sending me messages in my Instagram. Hey, they got they got cat eyes. You better go check them out. So thank gosh for her stalking Shop Miss A because I would miss out on it because I don't always think to go and look every day at Shop Miss A to see what they have new. And it's always different. They could drop stuff at night. They could drop stuff during the day. They could drop stuff two or three times in a day, or they could go several days without dropping anything. So they're really inconsistent when it comes to that. But thank gosh for subscribers who keep me in their thoughts, and when they see something they think I like, they're like, hit me up in my Instagram. So thank you, Mama K. You do rock. <laughs> so the first pair of glasses, thank gosh I finally got some, even though I've got like probably four or five pairs. Is a pair of red ones. <laughs> Go figure. These are the kind of um, cat eyes on steroids, as I call it. They're a little larger than what I typically wear, but I actually do kind of like these. I don't kind of like them. I do like them. I like the way they're shaped. They got the black tint to them. I like the black tint. Um, they are pretty weighty, and they got pretty thick uh, plastic to them, so they're definitely sturdy. And, yeah, that's about all I can say about them. I just, I like them. They are definitely me. That's for sure. <laughs> so, found these. They're already gone. So, I checked uh, the next day. They were gone. <laughs> so, like I said, sunglasses are the hot ticket item right now. 
they're buying them up like crazy. So, like I said, if you see a pair of sunglasses on Shop and Say and they still got them, throw me your cart. Try to find you a couple other items really quick and check out really quick so you don't miss out. Because they will go extremely fast. I got two of these actually. These are not typically what I would wear, but I thought I'm gonna try them anyways. I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone when it comes to stuff <laughs> like colors and clothing and items, and because I am definitely a creature of habit. So, so I got these round glasses. They are um weird. <laughs> They kind of connect up here instead of, you know, at the nose bridge. They do have wire, have ear protectors. This part is plastic. They have that mirrored effect. These are kind of a blue. Yeah, definitely a blue tinge. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> this thing is like hitting the top of my head and it feels weird. It's like right there on my head. I can't pull them up any further. There. It probably help if I didn't have that thing <laughs> sticker in my way. I, they're okay. I don't think they're going to block much light. But I think they're more just for, hey, look at me. I'm cool. I look like John Lennon kind of thing. So, I don't know. They were a dollar, like I said. It'll add to my glass collection. Because I have an eyeglass collection going on now. I really need to do an update. Um, update. Uh, video on it. There we go. Because I have definitely started to rack up the sunglasses now. So I got the pair of purple ones. Peakish purple. So they have that mirrored effect. The same thing. The wire. Holding it together basically. With the plastic here. They got ear guards. Um, I will say these are. I was going to say cheap. Not cheaper feeling. They're more flimsy compared to like these thick plastic ones here. So you would probably stand more of a chance of breaking these than you would these. These just feel a little bit more to be expensive and these just feel a little bit cheaper. If that makes any sense. I don't know. I don't make a whole lot of sense at times. I just don't like the way that thing rubs right there. Um, I don't mind these. I actually don't mind the color of these. Everything is a pink color. Like I'm looking through rose colored glasses. If you know that song. <laughs> Old country song. Rose colored glasses. But, um, I don't know. These ain't too bad. I just, and I'll tell you what it is. I'm not a big fan of blue. I've never been a blue person. And I think that's really what's turning me kind of off of these. Because they're blue. I don't know. But, I just, I like the pink ones better on me, I think. I like the way they look better. So, Anyways, got those. Like I said, they're they're all sold out on that style. I think all of these are sold out on those styles, unfortunately. So I got another pair. It's the same style as the red ones. These are just in white. The cat eyes on steroids shape. <laughs> if you see my other cat eyes, you know why I'm calling these on steroids. They're a lot thinner and they point out more. Kind of like the classic cat eye style but these are the black uh, lenses which I like the black lenses um, and I like these this will be like my third pair of white <laughs> I think I had three pairs of white cat eyes so like I said the same weightiness the same plastic same as the red pair I like them I like them a lot so these are really some some old steroids here. I think they called them cat eyes. I'm not too for sure if I would say that they are cat eyes. But this is the next style that I got. And it got that damn brown tint to it. I thought it was going to be black. Uh, but this is tortoise shelled. Colored. I'm not a big fan of the tortoise shell. I have several pairs of tortoise shell glasses. But I'm not a big fan uh, they have a slight kind of V tool, but these are more rounded to me than actual cat eyes. So, I mean, they're okay, other than I just don't care for the brown tint, but I'll still use them and wear them. 
I said they have the same weightiness. They're the same thick plastic. I don't think that they would be easy to break. Yeah, I like them. I mean, kind of like them. I like the other. I like this shape better than I do this one. But I'll, like I said, I'll still wear them and stuff. They'll still be in my collection. Heaven forbid I stop hoarding stuff. So here is the last pair, and it's the exact same pair as the tortoise shell. These are just in black. I think that this style is sold out as well. Now this has this has a black lens, but it's a gradient to the lens, so it's lighter down here. I like these better than I do the tortoise shell, just because of lens color alone. Um, but yeah, it's same style. It feels good. It feels comfortable on my face weightiness to it so yeah definitely yes if you're into sunglasses if you're a sunglass whore like i am and you try to hoard them up definitely start watching shop miss a they take tend to get a lot of glasses it's not just cat eyes you're probably thinking well if you're like somebody who doesn't like them well, i don't want a pair of damn cat eye sunglasses they have other styles they have like the huge round like 70s <laughs> sunglasses they have like the round ones. They just have all different styles whenever they get them. So it's not all cat eyes. So yeah, if you, you're not much into the cat eyes, don't worry. They have other styles. I just like cat eyes the best. So, because that's just me. Oh my God, I gotta take the Anyways, um, so yeah, we are at nine minutes. I was having so much fun. And like I said, my bag is empty. I said, it wasn't much of a haul. I just wanted to haul those sunglasses. As quick as I could, I got them all in my cart, got the hell out. I <laughs> checked out really quick. So I didn't want to lose them. So, but yeah, hubby is out playing with the band. I know I like push this band more than I do myself. <laughs> I'm just, I'm so proud of him. So I want to push them. They are, if they're actually doing really, really good, they're get their name out more and more around locally and start to get a lot more bars and clubs hit them up like hey can you come play a gig and so it turned they there's yeah they're just really starting to get noticed like their Facebook page they now they have over 2,000 followers and likes they're selling March like crazy now when they're out now they're starting to do autographs <laughs> people are want their autographs so yeah it's, it's really cool like Billy start to get a big head because <laughs> he's getting all famous I guess <laughs> so like I said, they're out tonight playing. Um, maybe one day soon I'll be able to go with them and watch them. Um, hopefully, like I said, someday soon. <laughs> Whenever I can sweet talk my bestie into watching my boys for me. But I do have a question for y'all. Um, I got a new camera. It's on the way. I decided to upgrade from... I like my photography camera. But I don't care for it for videos that much. And my phone works okay for videos. But sometimes I need my phone when I'm doing a video. So it's... I needed a camera for videoing. And I wound up getting a GoPro. And... I got it because it's small and it's compact. And it, it's able to get connected to the Wi-Fi. So I'm able to pull it into my phone for editing. Because I don't have a laptop. Which I guess that would probably be the next thing. I probably need to go ahead and get it, is a laptop. But I thought it would be cool. Because I know some of y'all have been interested in um, Billy. When he goes out and plays and stuff. And I can't be there every time to record. I'm lucky to be able to go watch him every six months or so. So... I thought, and I bought a stand for the GoPro, so on Saturday nights, if he wants to, he could take the GoPro with him and hook it onto, like, one of his symbol stands, and y'all could watch him play. Um, if y'all would be interested in that, let me know down below. Say, yeah, we would love to see, you know, videos of him playing. Because I know this, like I said, there's been some interest. People want to see, you know, what happens and everything. And I've had people ask me, you know, about being a wife of a band person. Um, I will tell you, it's not easy. It's it's definitely not easy. But for me, it's definitely worth it. Um, it's, yeah, it's just, it's all worth it. So I thought about 
do another story time if y'all want to hear about that, about being a drummer's wife. And we can talk about that some. Um, but yeah, definitely let me know if y'all would want to see footage. And if he really gets to liking it and stuff, I may make him his own YouTube page. Just so he can upload his drum videos and stuff to that page instead of flooding y'all this page. Because some of y'all probably don't even give a shit <laughs> about some dude playing on a drum set. So... He might get his own channel here for too long anyways, just for him to be able to upload his drum stuff to it. So, but yeah, let me know if y'all want to see that. And yeah, and also the story time. If y'all want to see this, the story time, let me know. Um, but anyways, I want to shut up now. I've talked actually not quite long enough, really, for me. I usually get really talk, talk, talk. <laughs> but... Anyways, we got to go move on to the next. Actually, no, I got to move on to cooking some dinner around here. Then we'll go to the next video. So, anyways, I love you guys. And, you, well, boy, I fucked up my outro. Any <laughs> anyways, y'all have a great week, night, day, whenever you watch me. And thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And if you are new to my channel, hi. Welcome. <laughs> Usually, I'm more kookier than this, but I'm actually being kind of toned down tonight. I'm not as energetic, I guess, as I normally am. And I'm not really cussing as much as I normally do. So, but if you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button down below. Um, I'm starting to get a complex here that nobody likes me <laughs> because I'm just not growing at all. And I've been here for a while <laughs> and I'm like... I'm starting to get complex and nobody really likes me. So, please hit the subscribe button. It helped my ego out <laughs> a little bit. And anyways, y'all stay safe. I love you guys and I will see you soon. Bye.